It is my pleasure to introduce the candidates for Senior Champion of the International Brown Swiss Junior Show. There were two entries in the Fall Yearling and Milk class. Placing first was entry 3135 VBCV Grand Royal ET exhibited by Chris Fagley of Monticello, Wisconsin. Following in second was 1943 Siegert's Mandel Colette, exhibited by Mallory Siegert of Pasota, Iowa. Following was the junior two-year-old cow class. There were six entries. Placing first was 1977 Brook Lodge W Fireworks ET, exhibited by Tucker True of Perry, New York. Following in second was entry 3108, North Lanes L Passion, exhibited by Chelsea Skidmore of Union City, Ohio. There were two entries in the senior two-year-old cow class. Placing first was 1992, North Lanes L Snow Baby, exhibited by Chelsea Skidmore of Union City, Ohio. In second, entry 1989, Schultz Mary Wonderment, exhibited by Katie E. Schultz of Dillsburg, Pennsylvania. There was one entry in the junior three-year-old cow class. She is 2051 Random Luck S. Peekaboo ET, exhibited by Megan Douglas of Darlington, Wisconsin. There were three entries in the senior three-year-old class. Leading the senior three-year-olds is entry 2063, Cutting Edge P. Sherry, exhibited by Mike Barton of Ancrumdale, New York. Following in second is 2065, Onward Venegence, Alleluia, exhibited by Logan Warden of Old Wine, Iowa. There were three entries in the four-year-old cow class. Placing first was entry 2091, John Lee Secret Langwathby, exhibited by Dalton Freeman of Bremen, Indiana. Following in second is entry 2104. She is Lost Elm Vigor Silk, exhibited by Tiona Toluca of Kiwani, Wisconsin. There were two entries in the five-year-old cow class. Placing first was 2144, Rolling Knolls Again Journey, exhibited by Braxton Perry of Mingo, Ohio. Following in second was entry 3118, Maple Sugar Martha, exhibited by Chelsea Young of Timuth, Vermont. In the aged cow and older class, there were three entries. Placing first was 2166, 2166 Culp Gen Legacy Tierra ET, exhibited by Megan Culp of Mannheim, Pennsylvania. And following in second was entry 2150, Miami Hills Agenda Daisy, exhibited by Laura Fry of Logansport, Indiana. And in the component merit class, the winning entry went to 2170, Velker's Lovery Mo, exhibited by Dane Velker of Perryville, Missouri. We also have the dry cow from yesterday's class, the dry cow three years and older. She is entry 1660, Our Family Wonderment Fabulous, exhibited by Allison Rule of Abingdon, Illinois. Ladies and gentlemen, your candidates for senior champion of the International Brown Swiss Junior Show. Please join me in showing appreciation for these fine animals at the center of the ring. Well, it's been a terrific uh, junior show uh, in our cows. We had a beautiful heifer show last night. We have our junior champion out here. We're out here in contention for our senior champion, um, but they'll also be your grand champion as well. Nothing to take away from that beautiful fall yearling that was a uh, junior champion last night. 
Um, but you got uh, five great cows that we have out here in the center of the ring. Cows that uh, were a lovely mammary system, cows that are sharp and dairy and angular. Um, very deserving out here for Grand and Reserve and honorable mention. Um, but let's give all these junior exhibitors a nice round of applause for a tremendous quality they showed today. <clears throat> Sherry's going to go out and she's going to tap our uh, senior champion, which will be your grand champion and then reserve an honorable mention in that order. Um, but uh, just been a terrific show and uh, these juniors have done one heck of a good job. Well, what terrific uh, senior three-year-old. Uh, this cow uh, just got better the longer she got out here. Um, you know, it's been several hours since she showed her in that three-year-old class. But she's a cow, she's the epitome of daringness. She's a cow who wears a lovely mammary system. You admire this cow for her size and scale and stretch. Yeah, however, you would like to change her there, uh, there in the chine, make her a little bit stronger there in that top line. But what a cow that wears a lovely mammary system, walks with a great set of feet and legs. Gets a little closer placing for reserve. But I think our junior three-year-old, she's a cow, you admire this mammary systems. She's a cow, she follows our first place cow on that dariness, you angularity, you love the uphill run that she has. And also a cow that tracks on a beautiful set of feet and legs. But that sharpness and dariness, the angularity, a little more level in the other floor today over our beautiful five-year-old cow. When you get behind a five-year-old cow, you admire the high wide rear rudder attachment that this cow has. Not a big cow, but she is a cow that exists. Tremendous balance from end to end, but uh, three great cows out here for champion over junior show. Let's give these juniors one nice round of applause again as well. Congratulations to our grand and senior champions. The, the winning senior three-year-old is the champion overall. 2063 Cutting Edge P. Sherry, exhibited by Mike Barton of Ancrumdale, New York. Reserved champion honors go to the winning entry in the junior three-year-old cow class. 2051 Random Luck S. Peekaboo E.T., exhibited by Megan Douglas of Darlington, Wisconsin. And honorable mention honors are awarded to the winning five-year-old, 2144, Rolling Knoll's Noel, Agen Journey, exhibited by Braxton Perry of Mingo, Ohio. How about a round of applause for a tremendous junior show? 